Yay, I'm excited. Let the name it begin. We're so excited about this. Are you ready to name? Right? So everyone has names and has a, there's some examples here. Ifi, Adekunle, Abubakar, James, and Ikuchiko. Right? And I'm sure you also have a beautiful name. So let's the name it begin. Always make sure that the numbers are grouped with a comma after each three digits. Make sure that they are grouped with a comma, right? So let's see some numbers that we have here. It's an example. One, I'll write it out here. Uh, 174. So how do we say these in words, right? This is just three digits, so there's no, there's no need to put a comma here. That will not be necessary. So how do we say this? There's a hundred. And we say it, we just name them as what they are. This is what they are, what they contain. That's their own name, their own first name. So we say 174. 174. Let's see another one. This is 809. Right? Eight hundred and nine because there is nothing in the tens place, right? Okay. This time around we have thousands, so let's see this one. Uh, this is three, comma one two four. This is where it gets really interesting. You see, we have another group, and this actually belongs to the group of thousands, isn't it? So we start from our left and say we have 3,000, comma, 124. You see that? 3,000, 124. Another one, 78,000. This one doesn't have a comma, so I'm going to put it for. 51 so one two three there should be a comma and this is still within the group of thousands so how many thousands do i have i have a 78 thousands right 451 is that amazing good let's see stem around Let's add some millions. Let's see what we have here. Okay, we have 421. Okay, sorry. Sorry, it's not 421. Let's see what we have here. So we have 4, 241. Then we have 3, 2, 8. Let's see. So we start from the left as usual. What group is this? After the hundred tens and units, this is thousands and then followed by millions. So how many do we have in millions? It's just a single million, right? So we have four millions, 241,000, 328. You see that? This is the millions place. That's the group. What do we have in the million? We just have four million. In the thousands, we have 241,328. Let's move on and see. Two. So here we have seven. And then we have nothing here. Right, so let's see again. This is seven million. There is nothing in the thousands place. All of them are zero. So we don't say zero, zero, zero thousand or zero and zero and zero thousand. No, we just keep that. But when you are writing it in numbers, you have to take note that you have to put the zeros. But saying it in word, this is seven million. 285 that tells us there's nothing in the thousands place right 7 million 
285 and you can see as i am writing it that after each group there's a comma seven million comma tell nothing here so we have 285 good good let's see now to the billion we have one this one has no comma so i'll just write it out one oh four three eight two four seven and then we have five two one let me put the comma myself one two three even though i've written it out myself like that yes yes so you also start from the back putting the comma so we have the hundred tens and units place this is the thousands this is the million and then how many billion do we have and then we just put names to it oh we have one billion four hundred and thirty eight million two hundred and forty seven thousand five hundred and twenty one is that again one more time let's see this one now we also have six billion okay there's a comma here okay i won't say that in word six we have two zero four and then we have three 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 and then we have one two four good so let's say this out now this is also this is hundred tens and units this is the thousands group this is for million and then billion so how many billions do we have six billions right six billions right two hundred and four million two hundred and four million three hundred and thirty three thousand one hundred and twenty four so that's it we just say their names as it is as it appears right giving them their own first name that's where they belong to and then if they are in a group of thousand a million or billion we say that lastly right and that's how to write numbers in words let's see what baby panda has for us today he says take your quiz <laughs> let's see what we have learned for today we group the digits that's very important we always group the digits and then then we say oh sorry then we say that's supposed to be the first name then we say the first name and end with the last name of the group right i want to believe you'll be keeping a good note so that you can refer to this later in future you are doing an amazing job i've been telling you that i am very very proud of you just two more lessons to go right and then